Hi, it's Tanya from My Forking Life, and today we're in the kitchen and we are making a classic recipe, Southern style potato salad. Now this is a potato salad that, you know, every cookout or event, gotta have a good potato salad. It's basically made with potatoes, a little bit of mayo, a little bit of mustard, and you know, some other ingredients. All right, so let's get started. If you need the full ingredients and recipe instructions, you can find that over on my website as well. Boom. So I've got here some Yukon gold potatoes. You could also use red potatoes. You could also use russet potatoes. Um, these are the best kind of potatoes because they hold their shape a little bit better in the potato salad. But if all you got is russet, then use the russet. All right, I'm gonna start by prepping our potatoes for this dish. So I've got here about two pounds of potatoes. I'm going to peel them and cut them into large chunks and then I'm going to boil them. And I'm just gonna chop these potatoes into large chunks. Someone told me these chunks are too large, so I'm gonna cut them just a little bit smaller. All in my business. All in my potato salad business. And now we're gonna cover these potatoes with some water. So there's about like two inches covering the water. Get some old water. <laughs> And I'm gonna just add a little bit of salt. So it boils in salted water. All right, bring that to a boil and let it boil for about 10 minutes. Now, if you don't have hard boiled eggs in your fridge like I do, what, why I don't know, just go ahead and boil two eggs <laughs> while you're boiling these potatoes. All right, I'm gonna cover it to make it go faster. All right, so I covered this, so hurry up and bring this to a boil. I am not gonna keep it covered while I boil because I do wanna keep an eye on it. I don't want them to get too tender, but I want them to get tender enough. All right, so my potatoes have been boiling for about 10 minutes. You can see how tender these are. We don't want them to get too, too tender. So I'm gonna turn that off and I'm gonna go ahead and drain this. So our potatoes are fully drained, and as you can see, they're really, really hot. So we need to make sure that these get fully cooled. One of the biggest mistakes you can make is if you add hot potatoes to the dressing of your potato salad, what will happen is they'll all get kind of melty, and then you'll find yourself with watery potato salad, and we don't want that. So I'm gonna put this to the side and let it pretty much fully cool in this colander while I get all the other ingredients ready. So I'm gonna go ahead and start on my dressing. I am going to add about three-fourths of a cup of mayonnaise. Adding about two tablespoons of dill relish. Gives it that nice tart flavor. Two tablespoons of good old yellow mustard and about two teaspoons of honey now honey is not gonna make this sweet what it's gonna do is just basically balance those other flavors the tartness of that relish and the mustard and it's gonna be real good all right so just go ahead and just give that a mix and I'm just gonna set this to the side as well and now I'm going to chop my veggies. I've got a red bell pepper here, a sweet onion, and a celery um, stalk. And I'm gonna just use half of the red bell pepper and half of the onion. And I'm just gonna put these in that bowl where I have my dressing in. Adding half of my sweet onion that I have chopped. Two hard boiled eggs. Let's give these a good, like, you know, rough chop. Yolk and all. Mm 
This is what our dressing looks like so far. Super chunky, and then we're just gonna wait to add our potatoes. All right, so our potatoes have cooled enough, so now I can add them to this. And if you find your chunks are just too big, you can kind of break them up while you stir the potato salad together. Make them just a little bit smaller. Get everything nice and mixed up. So now that I've mixed everything up, I am going to cover this with a little bit of plastic wrap and I'm going to let that chill in my fridge for at least an hour or overnight. This is going to help those flavors basically melt together and it's just going to make your potato salad taste even better. Alrighty. Alright, and now that your potato salad has chilled, go ahead and remove that plastic wrap. You'll want to taste it and season it with salt and pepper. Definitely add a little bit of salt. And black pepper. Mix that in. and garnish it with a little bit of paprika. Oop, that's a lot. Don't put too much paprika like I just did. Mm -hmm. mm. And there you have it, good old potato salad. Alrighty, and now time to get some potato salad. <laughs> yum, yum, yum. Where's my fork? Good old taste test. Mm -hmm. mm. It's really good. All right, y'all. Till the next time. <laughs>